I'm Miro. I'm Gia. We're the fifth generation, generation of, of the Giacomazzi Dairy. I'm here with my great grandmother, Lilia Giacomazzi, who is 105 years old. What is your secret to living 105 years? Uh, eating your three meals a day and then uh, being uh, very uh, involved. What is your favorite thing about living on this dairy? You feel like you're uh, not tied in, you're uh, free to go out, you go outdoors and uh, around, and I always love to hear the birds singing. This is my great-great-grandfather, Luigi Giacomazzi, who founded our farm 125 years ago in 1893. This is my great-grandfather, Fred, the second generation. What did he like to do on the farm? Well, he was the one that managed the farm. What was his favorite thing to do? When he was younger, he was milking cows. This is my grandma, Jackie Giacomazzi, who is 79 years old. What is your job on the farm? Well, I have several jobs, but the main job is paying the men for the payroll, and I also pay bills. This is my grandfather, Don. He is the third generation of the farm. What was Nono's favorite thing to do on the farm? He liked the dairy cows, but most of all, he liked to go out and irrigate the crops. Were you born on the farm or were you born in the city? I was born in the city, but I have lived here for 55 years, so I think now I'm a farm girl. This is my dad, Dino, and he is the fourth generation to run the farm. What is something that you like about your job? The thing I like most about my job is that I get to do my three favorite things every single day. Which are? And that is take care of cows, help people, and play with computers. Do you like any of those things? The last one. Tell me something interesting about dairy cows. One of the most interesting things about dairy cows is that they can eat a lot of things that we throw away. And on our farm, we feed cows orange peels and almond hulls and cotton seed and a whole bunch of things that humans can't eat that would um, otherwise get thrown away. Well, the they, cows eat them. If you said otherwise get thrown away, do they eat candy wrappers? They are, there are cows that actually eat candy that doesn't make it through the factory, right? They feed candy to cows. Can you imagine being a cow that gets to eat candy? Yes. This is my little bar, Gio, the fifth generation on the farm. Hi guys, I'm Gio. When I grow up, I'm going to be a farmer. So when the cows are little, they're called cats, and then when they're bigger, they're called a red Holstein, and then the red Holstein is called a cow. Sure. And then they start making milk like this. <laughs> when I grow up, I want to be a movie maker slash writer. That'd be pretty awesome. 